fire department's got the flag out there flying nice and high. It's nice to see. Yeah. Hey, you gotta be careful, there's more people out there today. So you gotta watch out for the riders. Okay. Seriously, they'll hit you. Hey. Yeah, this place is pretty awesome. This is just down the road from us at the house. And uh, that's a great place to take your dirt bikes or four wheelers or whatever you have. Look at all this area they got to ride. <laughs> Pretty nice little mud pit down there. If anyone wanted to go down there, Aiden's way over there having a good time. Oh, Aiden wants to go into the mud pit. We're gonna see how this turns out. Nice. So right now we are putting up a second <clears throat> a second fence here, an extra barrier. You excited, son? Mm -hmm. All right, we're putting up a second barrier here. We're gonna roll this. I think it's about three feet tall. We're gonna roll it all the way down the whole fence. Should be fun. We're gonna put it together with this uh, wire. Drinks yep. OU soda. Yeah, OU soda now. Nice little fence back here. About to be a really nice fence back here. Some cats hanging out. They like to hang out while we're working. Hey, we uh, did we figure out names for these other two cats yet? Um, Tom Tom, and then I'm naming the the really pale one, Potato. Potato. Chip. Potato Chip. Okay, yeah. No, I wanted to name this orange one. I don't even know if it's a boy or girl. I don't even care. I'm gonna name this one Tom, old Tom Cat, and then he said he's gonna name that one over there, Potato Chip. So we got Salem, Tom, and potato, potato chip. chip. And All cookie right. and vanilla. Yeah, you just keep naming stuff after food, huh? Yeah. That's funny. Yeah. All right, let's get to work. You ready to get to work? Yeah. Let's do it. so funny a second ago our orange cat tom 
tried to go through the small holes. And it did not work out so well for him. He got his head through. He got his head through, but then he got stuck. Pretty funny. Aiden over there using our nice gate. What are you doing, son? You like Salem? Yeah. White cat's really checking out that fence. Tom's like, don't go through it, man. You'll get stuck. Well, attack him. That's pretty funny. So I went to the store and bought a little uh, chain and a little latch there. Try to open the gate with it closed. All right. Now, see how easy it is to get in and out. Yeah, pick up the gate a little bit. There you go. Very nice. What do you think, son? Awesome. Now, make sure you lock the gate. Make sure you pull it all the way to it. You got to pull it all the way closed. There you go. There we go. Yeah, I think that's gonna. I think that's gonna do good. You like that cat? Yeah. Well, this is pretty much what it looks like. This is pretty much the finished product. Um, as you can see, we got the regular hog panels, but then we got this chicken wire on the outside of it, all the way around the fence. So I think that'll do good keeping out, uh, you know, keeping the dog in. And so I think that'll do good keeping the dog in. The cats can't even get in and out of this. So that's good. <laughs> See, the cats can't even get in and out. So a puppy ought to be just fine. too shabby if I don't say so myself I think this uh, fence here will do just fine nice little area here to run around in go to the bathroom sometimes and whatnot if they have a cold compost pile over there boy oh boy oh boy I'm glad to be off work now just got off work I'm gonna finish this video up with you guys I don't know about you guys but I have to wear a mask all day at work no not the biggest fan by the way but it feels good to take that thing off. I can only imagine what the ladies feel like at the end of the day when you take off um, your bra. I heard somebody say that in a meme that we uh, now you can get just a tiny, tiny inside look at what it feels like to take that off. At the end of the day, it feels good. So I'm glad to get that mask off. Sure am glad about that. I'm glad I got the fence up. We got the uh, fence up with the little. Um, chicken wire around it so that ought to be good the puppy should have no problem in the backyard i'm excited aiden had a good time with the cats and riding his bike um that little dirt track down there is just a little bit away from us down the road down from our house so it's really nice to have something like that close that he can easily get to and ride his bike around so that's a lot of fun can't wait for the summertime i gotta get me a four-wheeler or a dirt bike or something a little goat cart or something so we can run around together out there that'd be a lot of fun i'm excited about that but i'll tell you something else something that's even more exciting than all that is my brother dutch over at keeping it dutch if you're not subscribed you gotta go subscribe he's at 299,000 subscribers he is so close to 300,000 subscribers uh that's a huge accomplishment uh, i'm so proud of you um, bro for getting so close and uh, hopefully uh, maybe in the next day or so you'll hit that goal um, So I know you're excited about that and I'm very proud of you and glad to To be able to be part of YouTube with you. Thanks for you got me started with YouTube. So I appreciate that um, So if you guys aren't already subscribed to keeping it Dutch over it keeping it Dutch um, Go over there and subscribe please my brother and he's so close to hitting 300,000 It'd mean a lot if we could help him get there um which I'm sure most of you guys are already subscribed, but on the off chance you're not, go check him out. Um, so other than that, I'm about to get out of here. I'm going to head to Wally World. I'm going to go get me like four pounds of wings. I'm going to grill up a bunch of wings. 
I'm going to see how many wings I can eat before I pass out. <laughs> you only live once, right? I want to go eat a, I want to I want to go home and eat a giant mess of uh, hot wings. That sounds like a good evening to me. So, uh, I hope you guys are having a wonderful evening. Leave me some comments down below uh, about what you think about the fence and uh, you guys you have your favorite places you like to go ride your your little motorcycles and stuff like that. Um, and what's for dinner? Let me know what you guys are having for dinner. Like I said, I'm about to go cook up a bunch of hot wings. And uh, it's always a good good dinner for me at the end of the, I'd say at the end of the week. It's Monday. Week's flying by. So, yep. And the new job's going well, by the way. In case you were wondering, it's going well. i got to do some traveling tomorrow for training. So that's exciting. Um, it's nice to have a job. I'll tell you what. The one thing I will say about this new company, I can't really talk about it. But I will say they are very extensive in their training. Um, I've been doing nothing but training for the last two weeks and I've got another two weeks, three weeks a month worth of training to do um, before I can really even do my job. So there's one thing I'll say about this company is that they, they do train their employees very well. So that's really cool. Um, I hope you guys are having a wonderful evening and uh, don't forget to do something nice for someone and treat people the way you want to be treated. Um, you guys have a wonderful evening and we'll catch you on the next video.